Hi and welcome to Cooking It My Way. Today we're going to do um, uh, chickpeas, scallops and chorizo with some onion. Um, I haven't really got a name so uh, that's all it is. What I'm going to do first is I'm going to get my uh, chickpeas on. So then bring them up to the boil. Then we'll chop the onion and uh, we'll uh, sort out the scallops and chorizo. chorizo. And we'll take our, uh, our onion. And remember, as we're slicing it, we're going to slice it around like that. Okay, so we'll start off here. Keep the because we want it nice and fine. We're going to keep these uh, quite close together as we're going around the whoops, as we're going around the onion. Dice that up. More nicely fine, most fine pieces of onion there. Do this three so I just want to uh, take the skin off one so I'm just gonna go down the skin like that get my knife to start peeling it it helps when you're starting the skin off you don't need another way again once you get this skin started it's quite easy to peel off Now, take your chorizo and cut, I'd say, into uh, quarter inch slices. Now, it's better to use the small chorizos like this than uh, the bigger chorizo because it does actually affect, it seems to affect the taste. Uh, I've sliced up the chorizo. Now, I'm going to swallow out the scallops. Now, the scallops, I want them uh, pretty dry. Yeah, there's uh, 213 grams here, or uh, 119 grams wet, uh, when they're dried. I'm going to get some uh, paper towel. Put these on the paper towel and try and get as much moisture out of them as possible. As you can see, they're quite wet. We don't want them, uh, we don't really want them wet. So, we'll keep doing this until we go through a whole lot of them. We'll get them uh, as dry as we can get them. I'm not putting any uh, oil in the pan, by the way. So, you'll need uh, best to have an unstick pan. Sorry. Start cooking these food. But the streets are already cooked. What I want to do is I want to uh, put a crispness on it. You can already see some of the oils coming out of the uh, streets. A nice, rich. Uh, orange coloured oil. Ow! Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, try not to burn your fingers like I do. You can see all the oils now coming out of the uh, street side. You can. And what I want to do is I want to get a nice crispiness on the chorizo. Put 
cook down the onions a bit more then I'll uh, add these scallops start cooking those and then put the uh, head back into the pan after Keep the whole thing up, put the chickpeas in and uh, should be done. You see like here, this one's got the little dark edges on, that's what you're looking for. Okay. Okay, so some of these are getting quite nice and brown now, so they're nearly ready to come out of the pan. Just turn them back over. The amount of oil that's come out of these Teresa is amazing. I was going to leave the uh, onion to cook a little bit more but it, it really didn't need it. very long to cook through all these scallops. The scallops are cooking lovely in there. The scallops are nearly done actually. Scoop them to the from and turn them. And you're ready for everything to go back in. And this few over here. Add the chorizo back in. Please get coated in all that sauce. Add a bit of salt and a bit of pepper to taste. scallop and chorizo. Enjoy your food and remember to subscribe. Bye for now.